through the carbonate, that's how I got free. Jump it back off because there's no stopping me. Postmodern player, sample tastic, flows it frastic. I get drastic. Hey, watch the plastic. Yo, I name check and leave you drastic. Welcome to the MacGuffin, episode 180. I'm Spencer. I'm Greg. Today we're going to be doing our DVD rundown. Yeah. Got it right that time. Mm -hmm. uh, for down. August 21st. <laughs> uh, that's sort of an interesting week. Yeah. Some kind of uh, serious fare, mm -hmm. some kind of lighter fare. Mm -hmm. um, strangely, sort of in the same mm -hmm. region. Yeah. Sort of. mm, yeah. Interesting. Uh, interesting how that worked out. Yeah. I don't know. But uh, let's, let's start out with the headliner of the week, mm -hmm. and that is the uh, Blu-ray combo release of The Dictator. Yes. We're talking the Sasha Baron Cohen mm -hmm. um, mock parody oh, of like Middle East mm -hmm. leaders uh, from the Republic of Wadiya, yes, as I believe yes. it is. Originally um, based on a book about that Saddam Hussein, about Saddam Hussein. Makes total sense. Yeah. Which, you know, it, I mean, the film was... Decently fun, mm -hmm. you know. I would mm -hmm. say probably, maybe number two for me, okay. maybe number three. Definitely okay. behind Borat, though. Well, yeah. I mean, it's still kind it, of it, it 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 had funny moments. There's mm -hmm. one sequence on a helicopter which mm. was particularly funny. Um, <laughs> I know which one you're talking about. Yeah. Which I mean, it's made yeah. its way on the internet and stuff mm -hmm. like that. But it's, it's as you expect, like uh, crass, and white, rude, and funny. Well, white Americans not mm -hmm. understanding yes. two Middle Easterners yes, speaking yes. in yes. non-English, so yes. they immediately, you know. Mm -hmm. Freak out about so what they're saying. That's yeah, some terrorist activity. Exactly. Yeah, occurring. yeah. I mean, it's it's funny. Mm -hmm. Like it's it's. I mean, it's different. It's sort of more of um, the Ali G type mm. story, whereas this one isn't pretending to that's be right. a real leader. It's like scripted, right? Yes. Yeah. I mean, you know, like he he has Megan Fox as one mm -hmm. of his harem, right. so yes. to speak. So yes. clearly, it's <laughs> fictionalized. Or is it? Or is dun, it? Dun, yeah, dun. yeah. Sasha Sasha Baron Cohen. just rolls like that. He probably does. But you know, it's it's still it's still pretty funny. Again, you know, not not number one, but still mm -hmm. a fun film. Uh, in terms of this release, you have twenty minutes of outrageous, never before seen <laughs> bonus content, which is really kind of probably the shitty stuff that they cut out in the first yeah, place. Yeah, or just like gratuitous extra minutes of a scene that was already, you know, right. funny or offensive. Right. So you get both the extended version and the theatrical version in this. You get deleted scenes. Note, if you get the one disc version, you get fewer deleted scenes, mm. so you want to go for that Blu-ray, mm -hmm. DVD, combo. digital combo. Explosion. Yep. And uh, you also get a music video Best love song, Your Money's on the Dresser, which probably would be pretty funny. It sounds <laughs> yeah, like uh, yeah. Sasha Baron Cohen doing a video for it. Yeah. Again, also, that is not on the single disc mm -hmm. version. And if you're a special collector, mm -hmm. Amazon.com is their own DVD box cover oh, wow. that you can Look get. That. So if you really if you really want the more obscure stuff, mm -hmm. that might be the if way to go. you want your friends to be like, where'd that come from? And you can be like, the internet, mofos. Yeah. And it's got the digital copy, too, so yeah. we like that. Mm -hmm. That wins. Mm -hmm. In the same general um, <laughs> geographical region, yes. but a very different story, very different, we yeah. have the uh, Blu-ray and DVD release of A Separation. Mm -hmm. This is mm -hmm. the, let's see, it won the Academy Award for Foreign Film, it won the Golden Globe for Foreign Award, foreign film it won the indie spirit award for foreign film did it win the teen choice award first <laughs> sadly i don't know i don't even know if teen as choice <laughs> what teens watch foreign films like seriously well like, you know as you you've proven time and time again that to you that is a stamp of approval i, on I films, would take that so therefore, i, would, take that, I yeah. would just was curious if but it was know, running the full <laughs> MacGuffin gamut yeah this is a uh, set in contemporary iran okay not, not iraq but iran mm -hmm. this time mm -hmm. and it's about you know uh, a marriage Falling apart, um, the wife Hence wants the to come to yeah America. The husband and daughter want to stay in Iran because she's got a, a father, I believe, with Alzheimer's. Mm. Okay, and you know she she goes to live with her family. He has to get like um, a caregiver. Mm. I don't know what you call that nurse, think, something yeah. like that, mm -hmm. for his father. And gotcha. you know stuff sort of plays out of that. Uh, Interesting. Very serious film. You know this is a. Um, Completely opposite of the dictator. <laughs> Pretty much, you know, in this one awards too, mm -hmm. which the dictator did yeah. not. Let's say yeah. that. And you know, it's it's really interesting to sort of get a portrait of Iran because mm -hmm. that's one of those countries that we're sort of pitted against mm -hmm. just because it's sort of like their leaders crazy. Mm. I mean, come on. And we, we hear, and we just hear very little about it because well, we're kind of behind the curtain. I'm also saying, you know, we had. A, 
crazy leader there for oh, a while. Yeah. So, you know, yeah. Yeah. Every, it sure. happens to everybody. Yes. Let's just say yes. that. We all end up with some kind of dictator at some point. Yes. But boom, <clears throat> boom, boom. Shh. <clears throat> Call back. Wah, wah. Topical. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> anyway, you know, the, this release, the, there's a Blu-ray and DVD. Not okay. combined. No digital downloads as far as I'm aware. But you get a commentary with the director, Ashgar Fahardi. Ooh. Far, 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 Farhadi, Farhadi, yeah. Ashkar Fahar, Fahadi, mm -hmm. Farhadi. Um, you get a, a special like evening with him, which mm. I'm sure is a little featurette about mm -hmm. it. And mm -hmm. then you Most have um, Birth of a Director, which probably mm. looks about his Iranian past. I probably, would, and what I caused him to want to be the director? Because I assume this is his first film. Uh, I don't know if it's a first film, actually, mm. but, you know, it's, I mean, how many Iranian films really get to pop in America? That's true. So, That's you know, true. Interesting. Mm -hmm. So next up, we're going to go into the realm of documentary mm -hmm. films, and we're going to talk about... Ch Not in Iran or Middle East, unfortunately. As far as we know. As far as we know. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> they, there could be twists. There could be forests there that we're unaware of. You know, I'm always amazed by geography. Now, we're talking about the Disney uh, nature film mm -hmm. Chimpanzee, which came out this year. Yeah, which I, I guess believe we talked about. We did. Mm -hmm. Or we talked about nature films. Well, we touched upon it. Yeah. Yes. It was one of, was one yes. of a couple. Yes. Um, but this is the fourth film by Disney Nature, mm -hmm. and this time it follows Oscar. Name mm. of the chimpanzee. Good Just name. FYI. I like As he, Oscar. you know, grows up and sort of his journey towards adulthood and mm -hmm. how he learns how to do everything. Chimping so, it up. Yeah, chimping it up, mm -hmm. as you might say. His um, ape like follies. Yes. And this has uh, got the Blu ray DVD combo. As far mm -hmm. as I'm aware, there's no digital download, but there's a whole bunch of different features uh, for each each version, the Blu ray and the DVD. Hmm. So it's best to get that combo because you yeah, get the best exactly. of both worlds. It's I, interesting that they're really starting to do that now. I think they're make, wanting people to make their decision. I, I mean, I think it covers all the bases so you don't have to double dip and whatnot. Exactly. So it's good. Uh, but you got like on location about the making of it. You've got. Uh, a, a music video, which, whatever. Uh, but on the DVD, the DVD seems to have most of the like nature focused mm. special features, like it has Sea Chimpanzee, Save Chimpanzee, which is presumably about conservation mm -hmm. of chimpanzees. You have um, Disney Friends for Change, which is presumably about Disney's, mm -hmm. you know, changing and stuff. And mm -hmm. then you have a uh, uh, feature right about Disney's conservation legacy, hmm. which is kind of interesting to think about. I mean, this yeah. is the fourth film from Disney Nature, that sub subsidiary type uh, production group. But, you know, I, I mean, Disney's been around for yeah. a long time, and they've done some interesting stuff mm -hmm. over the years, so I'd be very curious to check that out. So, yeah. that looks like a good one. And narrated by Tim Allen, so, you know, that's good. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> that would be perfect if he actually did that. That would be perfect because you know that's kind of a chimpy thing, yeah, right? Yeah, poor guy. Yeah, uh, so and, do a little bit more cocaine and run somebody else over oh, with this oh, oh, oh. lawnmower. And the final one we're going to talk about. There's a series of uh, animated films mm -hmm. that Disney was releasing in various, yes. you know, packs. I believe, uh, you know, like Pocahontas or something mm -hmm. was yes. one of them. There's yep. a whole bunch mm -hmm. of them. But who cares about Pocahontas? <laughs> yes, exactly. But the one I chose to pick was the 30th anniversary of The Rescuers combined with The Rescuers Down Under. Oh, yeah. Double the, pack. Yeah, this is a three-disc Blu-ray DVD combo. Nice. Um, Those are great. Not entirely sure uh, how it all breaks down. Presumably, each film might get their own Blu-ray. Yeah, maybe Blu -ray film, and then film, and then extras. Yeah, something yeah. like that. Uh, but, you know, there's there's some interesting stuff. You got a, a deleted song. Uh, Piolopitis? Whoa, 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 yeah. Piolopitis? I don't know. Peopleitis. Peopleitis. No, go. that's good. That's yeah. not, that makes a lot more sense. Yeah, it does. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Anthropomorphic animals, yeah, peopleitis. Yeah, that makes yeah, sense. I can see it. Yeah. The one that I found the most curious that I want to check mm -hmm. out, though, is the making of The Rescuers Down Under because at that point, uh, Animation was starting to transition to computers, That's and true. so it was a computer-generated animated hmm. film, Hybrid. or at least a lot of it was. Hmm. Um, yeah, so I'd be curious to sort of hear the discussion of mm -hmm. that and how that all sort of came about, especially considering that the first one was not. Yes. So that'd be interesting to think about. Mm -hmm. And then you have uh, Three Blind Masketeers, some animated shorts on there as well. So it looks like a, a pretty fun one. And nice. there's uh, Waterbirds, a Walt Disney True Life 
adventure documentary. Mm. Talking Not, about albatross, how I, the biggest bird in the world. Probably a safe bet. Fan. Yeah, probably a safe bet. Mm-hmm. But pretty awesome like yeah. that. Yeah. So anyway, that's our uh, our rundown for this mm-hmm. week. There's some other stuff, as we said. There's a ton of other Disney things. Mm-hmm. There was a house, I believe, yeah. coming out. Yep. There was season Revenge, eight, I think. Yeah, season, season one, Revenge. which mm-hmm. heard good things about, but I haven't seen yet. Same here. So uh, let us know your feedback and join us next time for a discussion about Peter Skarsgård. Yes. In honor of Robot and Frank. Mm-hmm. And you can always let us your, know your feedback. Words, good. Mm-hmm. Order, good. Yoda, <laughs> here. Um, at MacGuffinPodcast.com, Twitter.com slash MacGuffinCast, Facebook.com slash MacGuffinPodcast. Phone number, 323-761-9842. Check in. Get, get glue. glue. And we're on iTunes, Miro, Roku, um, Blip. Dot TV. All sorts of good stuff. Mm-hmm. See you next time. Stop me. I'm on fire tonight. Magneto can't stop me. I'm on fire tonight. Even Zod can't stop me. I'm on fire tonight. It's tight. Don't even try to bite the side of the Mr. Spock can't stop me. I'm on fire tonight. The Wrath of Khan can't stop me. I'm on fire tonight. The Borg can't stop me. I'm on fire tonight. Because I've got space game and it feels alright.